Hello everybody and welcome to another video and I know I look like trash but that's okay because I am trash as this video is about to prove to you because I'm going on holiday and by the time this uploads I'll probably be back home enjoying my vac um, I figured I would film what my room usually looks like so this is going to be essentially the world's most honest dorm room tour um, I am but a student, I am incredibly messy, like, and listen, it gets worse than this, I promise you. Let me turn on the lights. But I left it in kind of a half mess so that you guys can see what it looks like. <laughs> First thing you see when you walk in is the door. I have a pair of fairy wings, because who doesn't? And then two plastic bags full of other plastic bags. Um, and then down here I have... A bin overflowing my shower essentials are in that basket on this side we have what looks to be a mess <laughs> but in reality this is a very complex washing system this here is washing left over from the last time I did washing this is clean laundry from the most recent time I did washing and around the washing basket scattered is all of the clothes that I still need to wash and that is some police tape that I stole <laughs> Okay, this is like the only part of my room that's really kind of decorated. I just kind of put a couple things up um, So I have a poster from the documentary I was involved in making Which you can see at bit.ly forward slash disrupt rape watch it um, I have a thing that I wrote one time I don't know, I think it's kind of cool and positive. It's obviously very derpy, but if you want to read it, you can pause. Um, and then I have a couple of things that my mom gave me those, my mentor gave me that. Some Angry Birds, I guess, are these Tazo? I don't know. An emergency information thing. This is a poster from a band, um, and I, I don't know the band, I just like their artwork, but I will tell you what the band is. Morning Pages. Vernal Equinox, the band is called. Um, but yeah, their album artwork is pretty cool. And then I have this bunting with my initials on it. And just some cool like dog paper, I don't know. Inside it, there's like another poem. Um, and this is my pride and joy. This is Trumpunzel, and my friend made that for me. And yep, that's that area. Now my desk is usually covered in all the random stuff that I don't know what to do with but because it's exams it's currently covered with books um, and various stationery items. Then this is, <laughs> oh lordy lord, this is my food etc area. So up here, kettle, random stuff I didn't know what to do with and this is stuff for making tea complete with tea bags that need to be thrown away. Second shelf, low-key have some protest gear. Yes, this is a condom. Um, they are necessary because um, you use the <laughs> lubricant to wipe your eyes if you get pepper sprayed or tear gassed. And these are rubber, bu rubber bullet canisters. Life got real this year. <clears throat> And then I just have some random food items, cups, etc. And bits and pieces down there, stormtrooper mask. These are rocks from the quarry, because we went out there one time and it was a wonderful adventure and I wanted to take something home. And that's all my books. And ooh, bonus trash, just trash. Great. <laughs> pile of trash and a pile of cords and trash. My bed, unmade, I, and I'm watching Bob's Burgers. And more condoms, because I unpacked my protest bag. And I just carry around, pack up condoms, and water, in case I get tear gassed. And I was carrying milk as well for pepper spray, but um, I had to use it because I needed milk for tea. <laughs> and yeah, cool. Now over to my sink where I have no less than four unwashed cups and two forks and two shot glasses which 
are, are probably a health hazard. Um, <laughs> underneath here, oh look, another unwashed cup. And yes, over to my makeup table. And all of my makeup is gloriously splayed across the table, all of the makeup I use anyway. Here is where I keep my brushes. Uh, it's mostly empty because most of those brushes are in here. <laughs> this is some very, very old wine. Um, like, terrifyingly old. Definitely, definitely um, would kill me. <laughs> and I also keep kind of various accessory items in here that I didn't know what to do with. Um, you know, just the usual sorts of things that a student would have in their room. <laughs> Washing pegs, unused, um, some hair stuff, uh, some kind of random bits and pieces, bubbles, I never go anywhere without bubbles, um, more headgear, and yes, yet more headgear. <laughs> um, Yep, this is where I keep my clothes. We've got, oh, will it open? Yes, it will. Here are our shirts. The next drawer down is pants and skirts and stuff. And then the last drawer is pajamas. And then up here is underwear. And in this cupboard, it's all of my clothes that need to hang. All of my shoes, which are usually quite well arranged, but not today. <laughs> and up there I keep jerseys, scarves, warm things, yeah, also more police tape. And up there is all of my baggage items. So yeah. Hey, 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 okay. So, oh, also I changed my hair. It's kind of picking up a little more orange on camera. I haven't brushed it in quite a while but it is very pink. I used Manic Panic, no I didn't. Well yeah I did, I used Manic Panic Cotton Candy Pink and Crazy Color Cyclamen. And I'm thinking of doing kind of like a crazy color brand overview because I've used quite a few of the colors now. So um, let me know if you're like particularly keen for that. Anyway, somebody requested this video. They said, please do a, a dorm tour. And I didn't want to do it because my dorm is such a mess. And then I realized that like, so is everyone else, and I am not a lifestyle or beauty guru. My room is a mess. It is that way. Such is life. So I decided to do this video. If you liked it, you can give it a thumbs up. If you like me and want to see more from my channel, you can click the subscribe button down below. And I make new videos infrequently. However, um, now that exams and school is out of the way, I have three months in which I can do whatever I want to. So I'm probably going to be filming quite a bit more, although I do think it will be largely like baking videos and tags and challenges, things with friends, vlogs, just kind of low maintenance stuff because really guys, chit chat. Um, YouTube used to be my creative outlet and I also used to have a lot more time for it. And now I have just all of these other ways of expressing myself. I'm finding school so much more fulfilling, not more fulfilling than YouTube, but more fulfilling than school used to be. Um, I'm a lot more busy now, um, so I just often don't feel quite as motivated to make anything. Um, and I don't have a big channel. There's nothing obligating me to film. So when I want to, when I think I'm going to enjoy it, I will make videos. Um, and I'm going to make what is fun for me because at the end of this day, it, <laughs> at the end of the day, this channel is for me. So yeah, thanks for watching guys. I love you. Can't make a heart right now. I love you. Bye. Mm -hmm.